All right, multiplying and dividing. So these are a little easier than adding and subtracting. We just need to remember some rules. If the factors or um, the two numbers in the division problem, the quotients, have um, different signs, your answer is going to be negative. If they have the same sign, your answer is positive. So a negative times a negative is a positive. Positive and negative, different signs, this answer is going to be negative. Oh, how did this addition subtraction get in here? Negative 17 plus 6. So we're at negative 17. We're going up 6. So we end up at negative 11. At negative 17, go up 6. All right. 4 times a negative 3. It's going to be a negative. Different signs. Same signs, so positive. All right, now we have 3. Negative times a negative is a positive 12 times a negative 2. Okay. That's going to be a negative 24. Okay. I always think of it as um, piece by piece, so negative times a negative is a positive, then times a negative. Or if, you're, um, if you want, if it's an odd number of negatives, you're going to have a negative answer. If it's even, you're going to have an even answer. 18 divided by a negative 2, that's going to be a negative 9. All right? Different signs. Same signs, so we're going to have a positive answer. Different signs, so we're going to have a negative answer.